The earliest known occurrence of milk was during the Neolithic when some smelly primates saw small cows suckling and a big cow's tits. So the human thought, hey, how about I get on some of that? So he did. <laughs> Ooh, this is good. How about I try it with goat? <laughs> hey, this works too. This is pretty nice, but I can't get any more milk. So what I'll do is I'll breed the milk makers to get milkier milk makers. So then, many years later, a couple guys got together and said, hey, milk is good, but you know it's better capitalism. So he sold it to some people and like, mm-mm, milk's pretty good. So they bought it, but not many people could afford a full-ass cow, so they decided to transfer it by trade in the 1860s. But then, in the 1870s, a guy got up and said, I'm a classy fellow, so I'm gonna stop suckling on these boobies and put it in a glass. And then everybody was like, oh my fuck, that is ingenious. Because most things that are successful usually go this way, it became a business, which founded the Express Dairy Company. Then, a guy by the name of Harvey Thatcher would change the world of milk forever by inventing the... Milk bottle in 1884. I thought milk was already bottled. Then, 200 years later, we have machines to automatically milk the milk makers and transport four times faster than trains. And that, my friends, is the one minute history of milk.